September 29th, Teaching Others. Do you know what a tendu is, or a brise, or ciseau? Well, unless you've taken a ballet class or two, you probably don't. These words, while common to those in the world of ballet, won't mean anything to the rest of us. We would need someone to show us and teach us. It's no different with the gospel. Those who are surrounded by darkness often do not fully comprehend the gift God has given them. It's foreign to their everyday lives, and they need someone to help them understand. Today, we'll meet May Kakulka, a woman whose mother died when she was 12 and whose father abandoned her shortly afterward. For much of her life, she followed the only pattern she knew, one of abuse, hurt, and shame. She's here to share with us her true story on this Unshackled Daily Devotional. My younger sister and I were shuffled from one relative to another until I ended up at my grandmother's farm. She was already raising three of my cousins and didn't want me, so she treated me bad. And as soon as I finished eighth grade, she made me leave. Only 14, I had to lie about my age so I could work and eat, which meant I had to drop out of school. I fell in with other girls like me, went to dance halls at night. That's where I met Harold, the first person who seemed to care about me. When I got pregnant, we got married. Because he was a drunk and unfaithful, my sister persuaded me to divorce him after four years. My next husband was even worse, bringing home drunken friends and abusing me. I divorced him when my daughter was 12. Then I married Rudy, a man who was good to me even though he drank. I began going to church, visiting one after another, looking for some way to feel better inside, some way to ease the shame. Listening to radio preachers helped for a while, but I couldn't seem to understand the Bible. Then I hurt my back and listened to the radio for hours. That's when I heard the gospel that set me free. Jesus loved me enough to die on the cross to make me a new creation. The change in me brought my husband to church where he was also saved. The Apostle Paul wrote in Romans chapter 10, verse 14, How then shall they call on him who they have not believed? How shall they believe in him of whom they have not heard? And how shall they hear without a preacher? Friend, the world is full of people following the destructive patterns that have been laid out for them. They are trapped in darkness. But we have the opportunity to be a light. We just have to open our mouths to teach and open our lives to demonstrate the truth. Are you acting on this truth today? Unshackled, the longest running audio drama in history, airs on over 3,000 radio stations worldwide. Real people, real life stories, stirring dramatic accounts of hopelessness and the hope that changes everything. This award-winning program grips the heart with compelling and relevant stories of transformed lives. Without Jesus Christ, we are all shackled by sin, by our wrong choices, disobedience, and selfish motives. But God is at work, and the power of Christ sets us free of our bondage. Unshackled daily devotionals are built on true life accounts and help us ponder the application of Scripture to our lives. A key Bible verse is provided so you can dig deeper into its specific intent and what it means for our lives in these unshackled daily devotionals. Listen to a new devotional every day. And don't forget to tell your friends about unshackled daily devotionals.